don't think I can crouch in this game, so... And that... out. Shit. Still did it. Did it. Just open that. Just in, in case. Now we need to get teleported by this, I assume. Mm -hmm. So just stand on it and wait till we teleport. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, someone waiting, yeah. You fucking got, got it. Yeah, you get it. My favorite pastime. <laughs> waiting till the game plays itself so we can continue. <laughs> yeah. I don't even know where the teleports us, but <laughs> let's go. Sun Station? No, it's not Sun Station. Oh, it is Sun Station! It is Sun Station! <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go, Sun Station! Finally. Alright, we have a bit of time, we have a bit of time. Increased solar activity. <laughs> Way too many years ago. No use of the command received for 10 minutes. Opens emergency. I don't wanna. <laughs> I got emo <laughs> this is like a terrible idea. This is a terrible idea. Yeah, let's uh, let's tread lightly, shall we? <laughs> Where do we tread? <laughs> we gotta have to get across? <laughs> I can, I can fly across near the surface of the sun to there. you kidding me. <laughs> Luke, all I'm gonna say is that I believe in you. Good, that makes I at believe. least one of us. Uh. No, I'm getting sucked into oh. the sun. How? Oh. Jetpack! 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 I gave it all I had. How am I, am I supposed to like jump from thing to thing? Um, Alright, back to the favorite so gameplay loop pack your way I've ever uh, had, which is... Jetpack your way straight through the door, aiming at a tiny door with a yellow chevrons near the top of the tower opposite you. Yeah, yeah, that's what you're aiming for, right? I mean, I'm aiming for the other door, yes, but that clearly yeah. didn't work, did it? So yeah, it I'm just says jetpack your way straight through the door. Well, fuck your guides, that doesn't work. Alright, Polygon, you've had your chance. IGN, you're back, baby. Tag in. <laughs> the world's most legendary tag in. Oh, I'm dying to the sun again. Oh, yeah. I tried to slow down as much as I physically could, but... Flying is still shit. Alright, <laughs> as I said, my let's go to my favorite gameplay loop. Of trying to get back where it just were, to have another one shot every like 5 to 10 minutes. Yeah. Experiment, experiment, flying into the sun because every fucking video has the sun at zero G and the and you don't speed towards it. Let's go. No, not shine steep. The oh, sun. Oh, there's the sun station. Follow that sun station. Yo, sun station. I don't think that's. We're flying away from it. We're flying away from it. Maybe we'll wait for it to come back around? But still, the plan is just, just C. 
Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I remember we were trying this for a while. It was like, yeah, no, the we'll be really this fucking in every time. It, at like it's... three kilometers away, the sun just sucks you in mercilessly. Yeah. Like, oh, I'm yeah, trying yeah. to, we, I'm trying to slow down. I'm stopped. trying to slow down. We, we, this doesn't work. IGN. <laughs> what? Every other game does have has no gravity here. All right. <laughs> what the hell? I'm gonna, I'm gonna find the most detailed guide I can. See if anyone. You know what? I'm just gonna search out wild sun zero. G. Sun station 2.0. Let's go. Stations lining oh, up, boy. Station. Uh, hello? Ah, oh, there we go. <laughs> it, <can't afford. laughs> it just doesn't teleport either time. It's like, nah, fuck it. Don't want it. Alright. No! See, there is no gravity, right? Well, it's point two here. This doesn't have anything. Gravity's point four here. I mean, it's point four for me. Point four? And if we go out. We'll, we'll go away. Should, should I just go for it again? Well, we, yeah, we gotta go in between those two yellow arrows. So, oh, no gravity. What was different last time? Uh, how? Oh god, we're falling again. Why is it? Why? Gravity zero. Go towards it! Oh my god! <laughs> this is the most tense shit! Like. I can't, I can't get to. I'm drifting away! I can't get towards it! How are we drifting away? Oh no. That's it! We failed! Again! Look at this shit. This is, this is bollocks. Alright, how would I do it this time? How? What can I do differently? Well, if there's zero gravity, right? Oh, I just went. Went? Oh, I feel like knocking on that was not the play. Yeah, just tell me what's on the sun. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to yeah. try this like ten times to get it right. Uh, the Nobine built the Sun Station to trigger a supernova. This was to generate enough energy to launch the Orbit Pro. Using the time loop, they could launch this over and over, and the Nomai statues would beam the findings to them at the start of each leap. <gasps> Once you arrive at the Sun Station, however, you learn that it was unsuccessful in blowing up the Sun. This leads the Nomai to their high-MG lab experiment at the Ashwin Project. That's what the sun stations. Cool. That's our useless information. Where are we going next? We still need to wait for the um, sand. Ah, uh, right. Let's do some more of that. That's fun. Point yes. to approach. Yeah. Alright, I'm under the bridge. Alright, alright, alright. When the sand column is right overhead, step onto the wall pad, broken tower. Okay. Alright, go, 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 go. No! Uh, that didn't work. That didn't work at all. Get in our ship and try and head back there. Yeah, I feel like they were stuck in this for a bit here. Mm -hmm. oh, coming in hot. Well, you're alive though. Super alive. Alright. 
Yeah, when the sand column is right up ahead, stuck onto the walk pad, the broken tab. Well, the thing is, I'm getting lifted up, so I can't really step yeah. on it. Maybe, maybe you're supposed to be on the walk pad? But there's cacti in the way. Hmm. And not only that. Ah, well. <clears throat> There's, there's that one. Good find Where does this one take me then? I don't know. I mean, this has to be good enough. Hey! Did it! We're somewhere. <laughs> Twelve minutes until end of cycle transmission. Chancy memory statue. Ten minutes. Three seconds to receive data from previous cycles. Can't do anything with those. But there's a massive, there's a literal wall of text here, so. <laughs> a literal wall. We finished the evacuation of Ash Twin. We've also finished the evacuation of all subterranean plants. How far we've come since our expensive high energy lab. We need to keep our eye on significantly with altered environment here. To send the warp core to the final tower to us from the Black Hole Forge. And Ash Twin can be connected with Giant's Deep. Was not only by accident the core of a warp tower, the last to be forged. The course could have been forged faster. <laughs> Important point is we're all connected through Ash Twin now. Our friends in Chinese tested orbital probe cannon. If anyone can goad a device into exploding, it's likely Avens. Would it help to remind Avens that Mallow will be one of the Nomai aboard the cannon? Flux and Tass finished memory statues. When the Ashwin succeeds, the memory statues will activate. Pine and I have worked hard on the sun station. If everything goes as planned, the socks will prompt the sun's explosion, which will in turn supply the power the Ashwin requires. We're nearly ready to activate the Ashwin project. First, the sun station will receive the order fire at the sun, prompting it to explode. The ash from brought from Santiora from the oral probe can to fire back in time by 22 minutes. Exactly 22 minutes after the order received, the sun switch will again trigger the supernova. In total, each cycle created by ash will last precisely 22 minutes. We can end this cycle at will! Well, how? <laughs> These words are difficult to write. The sun switch did not work. If this close we've ever been, it's theoretically sound, we're only unable to power it. Suppose we redesign the sun station. A supernova is still the best choice, it's easier to express and accomplish. We believe we can still find a way to create a sun station and wait for the sun to explode in its natural timeline. We're halting our research into creating a supernova for this moment. Our comet is newly arrived in the solar system, we're anxious to explore it. It's been a very long time since Liz explored something new. Artificial gravity control. Well, if I turn this off, I'll start floating around. That's not good, right? Is it? Yeah, gravity's shutting down. And gravity's off. Turn back on! 
Turn it back on. Uh. And it's back. All right. So all I can do is move this ball along, see what happens. Mm -hmm. Removing the core will disable the Ashwin project. You're about to access the core while the Ashwin project is active. Well, what else do we do? <laughs> Let's go! Oh, that's where the... That's the that's the thing we need. Yeah. How am I gonna am I gonna have to fly over there? Um I believe so. Yeah. Disable the gravity. Oh disable yeah, disabling gravity would make sense for this. So then we have to in time fly this across the galaxy to other thing to get to the eye of the universe. I guess that's the like the final oh. thing we need to do. Yeah. So that's the big Awesome. How do I get out? Well, that's the warp, right? Just warp? Cool. Now you have the warp core. Oh my! Sh but now my ship's fucked. <laughs> yeah. So the, the solution so, of the game will get this now to the ship, get to the core of the universe, and then whatever we yes. find there is essentially the solution to the game. I believe so. I'll be honest with you. I've been looking at the guide in like sparrowic parts, so I believe this is this is the the thing of the game. Get this core into to the other place. But then, what do we learn at Black Hole Station? Or not Black Hole Station? Black Forge District. Oh, uh, me! I could I could tell you. Yeah. Black Forge District. Oh wow. Oh, it just says read the Nomai script on the table. Oh shit, you're at your ship. Maybe you can get there in time. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna say I'm gonna give this one try. But now that we sort of figured out the mystery, I don't know if I'm in the mood to try to do this in absolute perfect timing to get it properly done. Um, uh, I mean, I can't, I can't blame you. I really would like it. Yeah, it's. It feels like it's going to be something about time. Because here's the thing, the Ash Twin project takes a lot of time, and flying through Dark Ramble takes. Time. Yeah. Then again, you know, doing it this once on the first try without having to read all the scripture, it's going to give us a bit of time. So I'm willing that if we fail now, which honestly we probably will, yeah, give it one more shot. But then it's just. This game has led to such an amount of frustration at this point that yeah. I want to be done. I tell you.
Have you figured out what's at the Black Forge district yet? Mm. It, it tells you about a high energy. I don't know what that is. Cool. About something on the end between. Oh, you learn about the uh, warp core. Apparently, it was used by Clary, Pope, and Root to craft an advanced warp core. Right. Which powers the Ashwin project. The, the core we have was made by those three. Mm, I see. Is that a fish? No, it's this, weird, it's this annoying moving thing that we have to get past every time. And it annoys ah. me every time. Oh, we have to input the code again. Copy it. Yeah, copy paste it to the bottom again. Everything is super damaged. I think yeah. the, sh the ship's fucked. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's not worth repairing. We don't know how much time we got anyway. I want to know what happens if I do that. No, oh! it's us. I thought that could be a really cool strategy if I sent a scout out. All oh, right, so as I go. Yeah. Oh, the you track. are dead. I am aware I am dead. <laughs> Yes. Credits roll. Credits roll. <laughs> you actually had lives. <gasps> Credits do roll! <laughs> we did it! What? We beat the game! Congratulations, everybody! <laughs> we did it! <laughs> ah, well, too bad. We didn't beat it. Um, I really, I really want to see what happens, but you're done, right? I mean, I'm really frustrated at this point. I might come back at some point to try one perfect run, but I'm yeah. so frustrated by this game. No, I get it, man. I get it.
It's a shrine, because we are that close, right? It's the last thing we have to do. Yeah. But at least this play session is over. Yeah. <laughs> it's... Because what did we do today? I want to say today was a full 50-50 on content and waiting. And then <laughs> after 50% playing, there was 20-30% to 30 pure frustration. So... There's something about that, right? But we we because we done we left everything that we didn't was frustrating. We left it to the end, right? Because we didn't want to do it. So today we just to clear it all up. Yeah, but there should be virtually zero frustrating things in this game. Yeah. Like it's always uh, if you know how to do it, you should be able to do it, and you should be able to do it quickly. Like Giant Steep yeah. is still the best example of how the entire game should have been done. Yeah. There wasn't any waiting at all, right? You fly into the tornado. Yeah, you fly into the tornado, and then you, you jump in the thing, and you, you've done it. Just straight up. Like credits. Because you died with a warp core. Because the universe doesn't reset. No, it doesn't. Because we took the core. <laughs> we took the core. Yeah. So yeah, I'd say at the when this game is at its best, it was it was really good. It was really fun. It was yeah. fantastic. When it's at its worst, it's at a point where I wish I just want to shut down the game and not play again. So it's a real shame. It's a it's an awesome mystery, boggled down by terrible mechanics and frustrating yeah. waiting periods and frustrating gameplay uh, sections. And it's a real shame. It's a real mm. shame. We we will we should finish this game, for sure. Yeah, at some point. Yeah. But until then, that is that.